Hello, my name is Larry. I work as a truck driver for a living. It's a great job. Unfortunately, it just caused me to pack on some excess weight over the years. I recently started to jog to get back into shape, and I've been running for about one month now. I'm up to three miles. I used to run back in my 30s, and I still have my old running shoes, which I've been using. I was making some great progress until recently. The bottom of my foot began to hurt so much that I can't run anymore. It is especially bad in the morning when I wake up. I went to see the podiatrist who gave me a steroid shot and told me to take two weeks off. The pain got a lot better during those two weeks, but when I started running again, the pain came back. So, how's your foot feeling today? Uh, it hurts pretty bad today, but it always hurts worse in the morning. Um, can you talk me through a little bit of your medical history? Sure. Uh, I had a heart attack in 2004, and I broke, bo uh, broke both of my femurs in 2002 uh, due to a fall from a second story window. Wow, that's quite a fall. What, uh, what medications are you currently taking? I'm taking Lipitor and Ibuprofen uh, two times a day. Okay. Um, tell me a little bit about your home situation. Who do you live with? I live with my wife and my two kids. And do you have any stairs? No, no stairs. Okay. Uh, what do you do for a living? I'm a truck driver. Truck driver. Um, does the pain in your foot keep you from doing your job as a truck driver in any way? No, it can get aggravating, but I'm still working. Okay. Uh, well, what we're going to do is uh, take a look at your vitals, like your blood pressure and heart rate. And then after that, um, I'm going to take a look at your foot. Okay. All right. Good. So, uh, what's going on with your foot today? Uh, well, I started running recently to get in shape, and I had worked up to about three miles. Okay. I was starting to get pain in my foot, uh, and a buddy of mine who's a podiatrist told me I had plantar fasciitis. Okay. Uh, he gave me a steroid injection for the inflammation and told me to take two weeks off. So I took two weeks off, but when I started running again, the pain came back. It's right on the it's inside bottom of my foot. Uh, needless to say, I can't really run anymore because of the pain. Okay. Um, and what would you say on a scale of one to ten is your pain right now? Well, right now, kind of in the middle bottom of my foot there, it's four out of ten. But if I start to run, it shoots up to about nine out of ten. Okay. Well, next thing I'm, what next thing I'm going to do is check out your foot. Okay. Okay. I'm going to take a look at your foot now. Can you take your shoes off? I want to see you walk barefoot from one end of the room to the other. And next time you come in, I want you to bring in your running shoes so I can check those out too. Okay, Larry, can you roll your foot out for me? A little bit down. Uh, roll it out a little bit more. Okay, perfect, right there. That's where your foot should be. Now relax your foot. Okay, Larry, for this next part, I'm going to test your sensation on your foot. What I want you to do is close your eyes and I'm going to touch different areas on your foot and I want you to tell me if you feel it or not. Okay, close your eyes. Yes. 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 And did they feel the same on both sides? Yes. Good. All right, Larry, what I want you to do next is pull your toes up towards your knee. Good. Eight degrees. And now I want to push a little bit further. Twelve degrees. Good. Okay, Larry, next I want you to point your toes down. Okay. One, two, 
150 and 170. Okay, Larry, I want you to move your foot in like this and hold it. Good, 30. Good, 35. Now I want you to move your foot out in this direction. Good. Okay, Larry, what I want to do next is um, test the strength in, in and around your ankle. So what I want you to do first is lift your foot up. Good. Hold it there. Good. Now can you turn your foot in? Good. Hold it there. Good. Now how about turning it out? Hold it there. Good. Now I want you to push my hand down. Good. Okay, Larry, now I'm going to test the other side. So I want you to lift your left foot up. Good. Hold it there. Now can you turn your foot in? Hold it. Good. Now turn your foot out. Hold it. Good. And now I want you to push my hand down. Good. Use the videos to complete the initial evaluation form. Use the SOAP note format to write a physical therapy treatment note for the patient presented in this video. Base your note as if it is the first treatment session after the initial evaluation. Make sure you state why you are doing each intervention.